Connectivity is the buzzword of the Paris Air Show, with exhibitors aiming to improve the flying experience of passengers and pilots. Panasonic says its in-flight entertainment and communication systems are the most advanced in the world. Used on a range of airlines, they help users undertake previously unthinkable activities, like watching live televised sport and conducting FaceTime with those on the ground. Panasonic's Matthias Walter. What we're shooting for, actually what we're close to really delivering is the seamless travel process for the passenger. So there's no difference between the experience that you have on the ground and the experience you have on the aircraft. Honeywell's Ken Snodgrass lauded the US conglomerate's cockpit design. This is the uh, Honeywell Primus Epic cockpit. We're actually sitting in the uh, Dassault F7X, one of the most modern cockpits in the world. It has uh, uh, four very large screens, and you'll see things are set up to be very, very graphical. So not like the older cockpits where you had a lot of button pushes. There's a lot more now like you use on your, your mobile phones uh, and also for your, your tablets. Snodgrass says it takes time for aviation to catch up with the interactive technology seen in phones and tablets because of the advanced safety checks required. Thales Group is offering a series of prototypes, such as its top max head-mounted display for pilots. Former French Prime Minister Francois Fillon tried it out for himself, guided by Richard Perrault. The top max is a very light and easy to use system that can be fitted in any type of cockpit because the installation is very light. You just need a few stickers on the other red panel and then the system has an optical tracking system combined with an inertial system. Talis's Sylvain Mousse is showing visitors the shape system. Shape is an innovative working position for the air traffic controller. It's uh, to speed up the interaction between the system, the controller and the system. We have no keyboard, no mouse. The controller is interactive with the system through the gaze information and the uh, touch screen. The Paris Air Show is the biggest in the world, with more than 2,000 exhibitors. It runs until July 21st.